often pierce that CME gap. It's always that CME gap. Okay. So, but Paul, today is is very different. Uh, last week was actually a very huge, huge week for cryptos. I think it was really the most exciting week since those uh, bullish days of 2017, 2018. And this is what I say when you have to look at crypto as an infrastructure. Many people were making money last week, about 50,000 people, lots of money. Now, let me explain to you. So but first, let's look at Bitcoin. And, and sometimes you have to read this, okay? Uh, it's really being stuck now at 11 uh, here. It's like, it's 10,957. It went for a while above 11, it, lip, it dipped back down. But there's a lot of resistance here between 11,2 and 11,4. And when Bitcoin goes in a range here, unlike other markets, see, we also trade cryptos. We love it when Bitcoin goes to a range. Because when Bitcoin goes to a range, the smaller coins tend to rally. Now, this is very important. So let's see a coin market cap. So uh, what happened is, okay, the, the market cap clearly went up. And the Bitcoin dominance, okay, 57 is not good. If it dips below 57, it's going to be very, very good for all coins. So what you see here is, again, this is good also. Ethereum, again, is, is struggling. I can't, you can't beat this 413 uh, level yet. It's not even gone above 400. Struggling here. But what I want to show you, something is very interesting. Okay, let's go back to the day here. Because if we look at those bullish... Okay, those bullish days of 2017, 2018. And there was one bullish spike in 2019 here. Look here. Ethereum has blasted past that. Whereas here, Bitcoin has still failed to go beyond that. 13.8. See that? So again, if Bitcoin does break uh, this 11.2 uh, to 11.4, the next is 12. Once it clears 12, hello, 13.8 up here. That one, see that? That was in June 2019, but Ethereum has already broken it. Why? Because of DeFi. And last week was a huge, huge week for DeFi. And uh, this is what uh, cryptos is all about. Okay, because last week, guess what? Santa Claus came to town. Santa Claus came to the crypto town unexpectedly. This looks like Jeff. Thanks, Jeff, because it looks like you. <laughs> <laughs> so look at this. Okay, now, see, when, when I say we're in crypto, you're actually in a matrix. You are part of a certain nation. And there is a new nation now. This is a new, uh, a new exchange, actually, Paul. It's a decentralized exchange. It's the main competitor to Binance now. It's called Uniswap. Okay, so look, you know, I've been playing on Uniswap and all this, and, and, and we'll study what the implications for Jeff on Uniswap afterwards. So you see this hike in volume. You see what happened last week. Everyone who had used this uh, account, and because it's decentralized, guys, you don't register here, okay? You connect a wallet to this account. That's why you have to come on Saturday. I mean, whatever it is, you just got to come, and I'll show you why. If you had connected on this, this, Remember this name. His name is Hayden Adams. He gave out 400 uni to anyone who used this. Okay? 400 uni was just dropped in your wallet. So you don't come to class on Saturday. Well, you don't know what a wallet is then. If something like this ever comes back again, you might not get it. Now, let's see the price of uni now. Let's go here to uni. Let's see what I'm talking about. Uni, uni swap, uni swap. Where's uni? Okay. Go. So uni now is at 567. 400 times 567 is over 2,000 US dollars. Let's look what uni went to. It went to like 14, but you know, it was very hard uh, to get out here because it went up and then went down. And then a lot of people were getting out at seven or eight. Uh, I got out at three something, my bad. So if you had gotten out at seven, say you had gotten out at seven, you would have made 2,800 US dollars just for trying this out. 2,800 US dollars into your crypto wallet. That's why you must come to the class on Saturday 26, because if you don't know that, you aren't going to get any. Now, this is how crypto works. You might say, uh, okay, do I have to use that a lot? Do I have to use that a little bit? Uh, Sorry, you know, Shuki, I, I don't understand. I don't understand. Yeah. Some guy gave you 500 of these things for doing what? For just trying this out. 
Because trying, when, are you 3,000 US dollars for trying this out? Yes. Yes, for trying this out, this, this exchange called Uniswap. I'm trying Durian out for $2,000. <laughs> I know. I know, Paul. You just connect in here. Now, Jeff always tells me that he's slow. He's the grandfather. That crypto is too much for him. Now, Jeff. Let's I'm listening, say, as always. If, had you connected to this wallet, you know, because they would have known that you had connected it. Had you where, was tried my, where was my phone call? <laughs> but you live in Tasmania, they don't have phones. <laughs> yeah, that's right. And had you tried this out, and oh, even, okay. even if you had failed, Jeff, I mean, you, you had failed, right? No, no, let's get this really clear, Shukri, right? Yeah. As far as we're concerned, you owe Jeff and I $2,000 each for not putting it in this. <laughs> put it in here, right? Even if Jeff I'll see you about it. Even if Jeff had failed, the two thousand or three thousand US dollars would have still been in Jeff's wallet. That's what it means. Wouldn't stay there long, I can promise you. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, and I know you well enough. You would have stayed there a long time. Don't <laughs> worry about that. It's a wide uh, day, right? It's a wide day. So, so this is the buzz, right? So Uniswap recaptures DeFi buzz with Uni tokens airdrop. That's what an airdrop is called where a token or a coin, so it's, it's like an IPO. It's basically their IPO last week. They, they released this, so, so, so they got listed. So all the coins of Uni here were dropped into the wallet. Had you used this Uniswap, it, 400 would have come. Now, here's the thing now. Uh, I didn't provide liquidity here, okay, because uh, you know, sometimes it's quite expensive, what they call the gas fees. But people who are providing liquidity now, to make it easy, people who are farmers here, look at what they were making. I'm going to move this down. See, a friend of mine who provided liquidity to Uniswap 1 for a long time received half a million USD airdrop. Look at that. Just times that by five. That's like 600,000 US. So when I see you ask a couple of thousand dollars, I may have been wrong. You may ask a little bit more than that. Yeah, I know. I know. So, so this is the thing in crypto. I think Jeff understands this because he was in a mining town, right? Everyone wants customers. So everyone is trying to motivate you to use their services because, you know, Uniswap is, is, is actually funded by venture capitalists. So again, uh, they had a venture back capital products, very famous venture, Anderson Horowitz, Union Square, no, Paradigm. No, no, no. Sorry, Shukri, I've got a couple of questions coming in about yes. this. And look, um, we've got the full event on Saturday and there'll be a, uh, for the Actions to Wealth Online Trading Profit Clients, there's an email coming out tonight, which will include details cool. of how to register for Shukri's course on Saturday. It'll also be posted all over the social media this week. It'll be on the Telegram. You guys should be on our Telegram. If you're on YouTube, click on the link, go to Telegram. If you're subscribed, if you liked our channels, if you joined our channels, we'll let you know all the details about how to get a day with Shukri on Saturday for... Shukri, I've decided to change the price. Is that Okay. Yeah, sure. And, and, and instead of 250 bucks for the day, we're doing it for free, mate. Sure, sure. Yeah. Day, day yeah. with you for free. Okay, it was always free. But yeah, you know, it's worth it. It's worth more than that. I've got a it's million dollars. Um, no. Shukri, I've got to keep you in the next 30 seconds because we've got to move on. Sure. We've got Angie waiting on uh, gold. Sure. We've got uh, Sh uh, Pingney um, waiting on oil. We've got Jeff waiting on some technical stuff. It's been a great show. We've got lots more to come. Stay with us. We're doing Forex Trading Live. Awesome. So guys, again, this is the second time it happened to me, okay? The first time it happened to me, I got 1,500 US dollars of on. It didn't last for long. There's another one that's coming for me again, uh, end of September, it's called Definity. So guys, get in, no wallet. Uh, you don't have a chance to get money. You have a wallet. Well- Are we getting into this on Saturday, Shukri? Uh, we're gonna create some wallets, yeah. But again, you, you don't know which where, where the reward is gonna come from. But once again, if you don't even know what wallet is, is you can't get your first wallet up. How can you get the rest of the wallets up? That's um, that's brilliant. I was saying the other day that uh, yeah, I, I think um, yeah, I've got at least three crypto wallets and they've all got yeah. money in them. I don't know the password to any of them. Um, you need more. You need more, Paul. Need We're going to create more for you. <laughs> I know, yeah. Look, honestly, if you can put a couple of thousand dollars a week into the week, and I'll get a few more, mate. Don't you worry about that. I'll find a way. I'm not so good at these things, but I will find a way. Shukri, is that us on crypto for today? Yes, that's it. Cheers, mate. Thank you very much. A pleasure as always. Ainsley on gold. Ainsley, is this damn thing going to break out? Are we going to go somewhere on gold finally? I'm over it. I'm uh, well. To be quite honest, having had no, <laughs> having had no um, internet, no computer, and no screens for about the last three and a half weeks, because they've been packed in storage, and I've been moving house, and I only got internet back on Friday afternoon. 
it's probably been really good. But the problem for that is, guess what? It should have done a really big, strong rally and we haven't had it. Um, Paul, have you got a chart you can chuck up, please? Um, yeah, I can. This best PH still around because he's good at this stuff, you know. Yeah, he is. He's a legend on this. Yeah, yeah. But, I'm still, sugar, I'm, I've got to. I've got to. I've really got to spend some more time on this crypto when I get myself sorted yeah, because awesome. I'm sure it all really makes Come sense. Enjoy it. Look, um, you, I think you're the, you're the only one that doesn't have a crypto expert in the family. Julian's uh, sons into uh, into I crypto. Know. Paul Hutton's sons into crypto. Isn't he PH? Your sons yeah, into crypto, yeah, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let's no, tell you, she's pretty much under 40 is yeah. in the crypto. Yeah. So that means, Ainsley, Ainsley, that means you will be richer than your kids. For the rest, the kids will be richer than them. Okay. Yeah, well, Are you looking for a gold oh, chart? Gold. XAU right. USD. Yep. Oh, no, not AU. Thank you, Dan. Right. Excellent.